Hey weirdos, it's me Betty from Betty's World and I'm back with another video. My mom is in the living room so this is kind of awkward because she can hear everything that I'm doing and my room is really close to the living room so that's great. Today we're going to be doing a Q&A. Yeah, this is kind of awkward like she's like... Okay, it's cool. Whatever. I hope you guys like this look. These are my sisters. She got it yesterday, so I'm just like using them. And today I'm like a blueberry, you know? So this is like really cool and I am fucking with it. Oh my god, you guys asked so many questions. Like, I was so happy. Like, I was like, whoa, you know? Okay, so I'm using my laptop. Look, I added more stickers. The first question <clears throat> is from softy and um their question is what inspires you to start a channel or what inspired you to start a channel so i was really young and i was looking up youtube and i was like whoa and i saw a girl my age and she made a video and i was like whoa i want to do that too i want to be famous so yeah i was like I, honestly i kind of wanted to inspire like at first i was i wasn't thinking about like making a video for like the black community i wasn't thinking about that at all until i started like growing up into youtube but like when i was younger i was just like oh i want to make a video i just want to like have fun and make a video just because and yeah um that's what happened cool yeah next question um how's life oh that's an amazing question i love that question life is going pretty good you know last year was pretty shitty not gonna lie it was not the best year that's all i'm gonna say it was not the best year but yesterday what are you doing like calm down <laughs> little buddy yesterday i went to the dance um it's called sweethearts and i went and i actually let loose and i stopped caring what other people thought and i just danced although i can't dance at all like i have a video i'll put in clips here somewhere but yeah i went to the dance i had fun and i let loose and i had fun and yeah cool okay um Next one is favorite food. Uh, my American food, favorite food is probably pizza. Yeah, pizza, pizza. I say pizza, it's so fucking weird. Um, it's probably pizza, pizza. Uh, African food is rice and beans and beef together, cause they're fucking good. Okay, I don't, I don't know if you guys know, but I'm African. Just you know, clarify. Do you have TikTok? I do have TikTok. That's such a wonderful question. Yeah, my, you could hear my mom from here. But that's such a wonderful question. I'll put my TikTok here. You know, actually, yo, I used to be a hater. I used to be a hater, okay? I used to be like, yo, TikTok is just lame and shit. But once you start, like, using it, because, like, it used to pop up on my Instagram page. And so I was, like, curious. I was like, I want to see if I could be TikTok famous. It's not working. It's hard. So if you guys please follow me and like my little, there's like four videos right now. So I'll put it here somewhere. Just like, you know. Okay, cool. I have a color. It's pastel purple, but just like any color that's pastel. But my favorite is pastel purple. Cool. Okay, next. <clears throat> I feel so cool right now. Like, oh my God, all these questions. I feel like I'm important. Cool. How did you find your aesthetic or how to find your aesthetic? Well, honestly, let me explain to you guys. I have two aesthetics. I have the cute, adorable, childlike, soft girl aesthetic. And then I have a 90s black goddess aesthetic, you know, where she wears, or I wear, that's fucking weird, speaking in third person, you um, know, where I wear like long skirts, big, like big oversized shoes, like very big heeled, heeled shoes and hats and stuff like that and so that's my second aesthetic so i have two aesthetics the way that i found it well i've always been into like 90s outfits but the way that i found this style was from um the show euphoria from what's her name jewels yeah i i was so i just i loved her style and the colors the way they popped i used to watch the sound I can't talk, I'm sorry. I used to watch the show in summer. So I was just like, bro, I want to be that colorful next year. And so I've just, I've been in love with colors and adorable little things and childlike and like my little teddy pig backpack. I just, I find, yeah, I love, yeah. That's where I found, or like I've, I realized I liked the colorful, childish, not even childish, the soft girl aesthetic from Euphoria. I'm nervous for some reason those were all the questions from softy 
and thank you so much for asking those questions. I appreciate and love you. Thank you. Okay, why do I keep doing this? I keep doing that. That's fucking weird. <clears throat> Next is from Bo or Bo. Bo, yeah, Bo. Okay. <clears throat> okay. They said, "How tall are you?" I'm like five three, five two. I'm not that tall. Um, how do you help yourself feel beautiful when you feel ugly? Usually, I just put makeup on, or honestly, I. Okay, I go on my Instagram and just check myself out, you know? I go on my Instagram and just check myself out or on YouTube and just look how beautiful I did my makeup and be like, damn, Betty, you're fucking beautiful. Or sometimes, like, I just, like, put makeup on or I put lip gloss. If I don't have any makeup, as long as I put lip gloss on my face, I'm just like, you're the shit, bitch. And then I go, that's what you gotta do. Check yourself out. Check yourself. Be a narcissist, okay? For, like, five minutes. Would you ever make an art account on Insta? Um... I would, but I'm not really good at drawing. I mean, I'm good, okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty good, but um, when it comes to like, I don't think I would. It's just, I love drawing, but it's not like my, it's like a little hobby. But when it, I don't know, maybe, maybe. Who knows, maybe. Will you post more videos about your art? I love art so much. Um, okay. I mean, my art is my face, my makeup. Um, but when it, uh, sure, like, why not? Like, okay. I was I got like a we did this thing at school where I won this um this paint stuff everything like paint brushes um I like paint palettes whatever like all those stuff so I was thinking about making a video but since you mentioned it okay if you want I mean okay I guess who inspires you with fashion again this um colorful like one color a day like type of style is from Jules from Euphoria or just Pinterest itself. And then my 90s outfit is just myself. I mean, I see pictures, I see people, and I just combine them into my own. Like the long skirts, um, the long skirts with a tight top, that's like the 90s style, you know? And I love that, I love it so much. I have like four skirts, four beautiful long skirts, and I'm just, I'm in love. I'm gonna do like a skirt, uh, like a long skirt collection. Yeah, that'll be cool. And also, you and your sister, oh, thank you so much. You're so beautiful. Thank you. Milky, that word, Milky Babes, because this, I'm fucking on. Milky Babes um, asked, when did, you dis when did you decide to go natural? So, um, in the summer of 2019, so last year, I was, okay, so this is what happened. We have, a, like, a little small pool in my apartment complex, and so we went swimming, right, and I was relaxed. My hair was, like, was bad okay it was really bad but like it was like long at the ends but it was still kinky like it was short kinky it was like here was the kink and here was the um the relaxed like i don't know how to describe it but yeah it was like really relaxed you know and so we went swimming and when i went in like the water it just like it like like just, it was not cute sis it was really ugly like it was just not cute so me and my sister we're so crazy so i want to take a shower you know us black people we don't want to be really really ashy you know it's just not cute so i went to take a shower right after i swam right i was like bro i was thinking in the shower i was like bro i've seen so many people on pinterest and instagram with their natural hair you know with their power to the people hair, with their beautiful hair you know and i was like why not like why not so i decided we like we sat in the mirror in this room we sat right there in the mirror she got scissors and we blow dry my hair and we just like cut literally it took like an hour i think we just cut it all off all the relaxed hair off and so um like some days when i'm washing my hair like the following week after i was washing my hair and some lengths there were like still there was still like some parts that were relaxed so i just brought some scissors in there and chop chop you know chop chop and so that's when I went natural like i didn't gotta i didn't go to a salon or anything you know i just like my sister helped me out so um if you want to go natural go for it i just didn't like it i was just like done with it every time i got it wet it just looked so ugly and like i just personally i didn't like it i liked my natural roots so yeah that was really great do you watch k-drama i used to and sometimes i do but currently no i don't it's good though it's really good especially the um romance romantic ones um how old are you i am 61 going to 71 you know <laughs> i'm so old i'm like a grandma you know like 
I could have like six grandchildren, you know, so I'm pretty old like I'm hella hella old Okay, do you have Insta or TikTok? Yes, um, I already mentioned my TikTok and my Instagram is Betty's World One two three Sorry, I'm acting weird. I, I don't know if I yeah, I'm acting really weird I don't know why I feel like a little celebrity because of all these questions like I haven't had so many questions in like forever so i feel like i could conquer the world you know what's your favorite aesthetic theme my favorite aesthetic theme is little like soft girl um like cute adorable like childlike things you know like this this is my sister's but this i love big things and like little like colorful teddy bears and like uh, like my little teddy big backpack i want a collection of just like animal backpacks so that's my aesthetic theme right now but tomorrow it might be like long skirts tight tops with my hair up like it's the 90s you know next one is from uma faro harris i'm sorry if i pronounced that wrong what made you want to start youtube and what tips do you have for someone who wants to start so i already mentioned what made me start youtube and um some tips if you're starting youtube is um have fun like honestly like when i first started youtube youtube i was focused on the subscribers and the views and the likes no i actually didn't care about the likes i was focused on the comments views and subscribers that's all i cared about and that's not cute like you shouldn't don't like i know it's hard but don't care start off having fun do what makes you happy and that's what people are gonna like get drawn to you know like makeup let me tell you something like when um i decided to make my red look video the one that like got so many subscribers and views i didn't do that because i saw other people doing it i was like because i used to experiment experiment with makeup and so i just decided to do that one and um yeah i just thought i got you know a lot of views and i did it because i wanted to and i looked good so do something that makes you happy and you don't want to get bored and like do something that if someone else like is on their phone watching your channel you won't get embarrassed you know so like i mean if, if you're like if you do something like crazy funny who cares have fun you know have fun that's what i'm telling you have fun and be free be free you know because this is your channel you can make whatever you want on your channel it could be a safe space it could be like a makeup place it could be a hair place just do whatever you know that's my tip okay do you have a favorite artist um i'm gonna sneeze wait i was just gonna sneeze just now that's crazy um <coughs> bless me you whenever my favorite artist is erica badu she's dope i love her i love her music um but my number one i mean erica badu is really cool she's like yeah, she's really cool. But I feel like my number one favorite artist is Aurora Arkins. I think that's how you say her name, Aurora. I can't say Aurora right. So yeah, her, she's really cool. Her music is so calming and peaceful. And like, it's just like really soft. And it's she's like a hippie, but like, she's like a nymph, you know? You just see her in the forest jumping like a little weirdo. And I love her. She's just ugh, Aurora. Listen to her music. Uh, favorite type of music. I have two types of music. I like jazz. I know people get so surprised. They're just like, Betty, you're like old. Like, why do you listen to jazz? So, um, yeah, I love jazz. And I don't know how you describe Aurora's music. It's peaceful. And it's just relaxing. So I don't know how to describe it, though. I don't know what genre to put it in. Aurora's music and Erica Badu's favorite historical era. The, let me search it up right now because I don't know which. Personally, I like the 90s because that's when they started wearing like mama jeans and they look so sophisticated. They look so fine, bro. Yeah, I like the 90s. I love the 90s. I mean, the 80s are cool too, but uh, the 90s is kind of like calm, you know? They're calm. Anyways, that's 90s. The 90s is cool. Yeah. Okay, um, oh wow, you have more questions. Okay, um, favorite color? It's pastel purple. Do you like to travel? I wish, Psh, I wish I could travel. That's the question, can you travel? <laughs> um, I want to travel. I can't, cause I'm broke. 
Okay, that those are the questions from um Uma. Oh god, I feel like a celebrity. Thank you guys so much for all these questions. This is so cool. Next one is from Honey Babe. Honey Babe. I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Okay, number one. What is your aesthetic like? I have two. One is the 90s and one is um a kid, a child, um, a colorful kid. Okay, number two, what is your favorite color? Pastel purple. Do you have Instagram? Yes, Betty's World123. Um, number four, can you help me find my aesthetic? Yes. All you have to do is experiment. Like, for example, do you like the 90s style? Yes or no? Try it out. See if you like it. Next, do you like colorful, like baby blue, baby purple, baby like whatever, like colorful stuff, you know? Do you like that? Next, do you like goth? Do you like, like grunge or just dark colors? try it out and then see what you like or if you like two or if you like three just see you don't have to have you don't have to stick to one thing you could have more than one thing like more more than one aesthetic okay next question thank you so much for the questions um huni okay next one is from jen jul jul jen jul okay how old are you i am 71 no i said <laughs> i am 61 going to 71 going to 81 i don't know what i'm saying anymore i'm fucking tired like after the party yesterday oh my god i had so much fun guys like i didn't know i could be at first it was kind of like whack the music was whack it was just bad you know but i remember this one quote okay it goes like um nothing is boring unless you make it boring you know so if you think something is boring no you're making it boring you know where is your family from mine is from liberia 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 but i'm first generation i'm from africa you know africa yeah like do you want me to tell you where like in africa like okay so I, i'll tell you me personally i'm from zambia but my family's from congo me and my sister are both from zambia but my other family are from congo so. okay favorite song currently it's yeah that's a hard question okay wait Oh my god, you guys, I feel like a celebrity. All these questions, they're so cool. Okay, um, from Erica Badu, it's on and on. Okay, that's from Erica Badu. But from Aurora, Aurora, such a interesting name. It's probably apple tree or just, or seed. Is that what it's called? Seed. And then from Erica Badu, it's on and on. On and on. It just makes me want to twerk, even though I can't. I really can't twerk, it's just embarrassing. Um... This is cool. Thank you so much for all these questions. I appreciate you. Okay, number four from Jen Jewel is for, um is where do you get a majority of your clothes? I thrift. Let me tell you guys something. So my sister took me out on my birthday to um the mall, right? And so she, I thought I liked the mall too. She thought I liked it too. You know, we were both confused. So we went shopping at the mall and I don't know, it was fun, I loved it, but I was slightly uncomfortable, you know? And so the next week when she got paid, cause she's just an amazing sister. And I just, I'm so thankful and grateful to have her as an amazing human being sister. Um, <laughs> she took me out to thrift. I think savers are goodwill, I don't know, but we went thrifting. And let me tell you, I was so happy, even though the clothes, they were so cheap and broke and they were just like cheap as fuck and old you know i was just so so happy so i realized that i'm a thrifter i just love thrifting you know i'd rather go thrifting than to the mall i'd rather like it's yeah i get most of my majority of clothes thrifting at savers or goodwill or any thrift store that we could go to because yeah like for example my skirts my favorite 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 skirts i get from um where did we go goodwill so i got no i got the skirts from savers and then i got the current skirt that i wore to the the dance at urban outfitters oh my god that place is so expensive like that's not cute it's like it was like 45 dollars for what oh my god i'm squeezing this <laughs> animes you've watched so far i don't really watch anime i don't i read anime but i don't watch it my sister ask her those questions she like when she makes a q and a ask her what type of anime she's watched because she's a nerd she loves anime so ask her those questions i personally i don't like watching anime i love reading it because i love romance anime and yeah cool okay 
um what makes you want to start youtube i already said that uh people i used to watch a girl and my age and yeah cool i started youtube at like 10 years old because i was a very curious child yeah anyways um what do you value the most in a friend mm. that's a very good question i love that question i don't want judgment in a friendship you know I, I don't want you to judge me and you you should know that I won't judge you, you know? My mom is so loud, bro. I'm so sorry. When it comes to a friendship, I want you to trust me, you know? And I'll trust you. And I don't, when I tell you, like, for example, when I tell you I fart, I don't want you to judge me, you know? Like, we all fart. We're all human. And, like, I just, I don't want judgment, you know? And I don't want violence in a friendship. Like, if you ever think about punching me, that's not okay. I mean... Like, it, it depends on the friendship, you know? Like, I have a friend. His name is Isa. He's probably watching this video right now. He's such a dork. Hi, Isa. Um, he, like, me and him, we joke around and we just, like, push each other. And, like, that's joking, you know? But, like, if I had another friend that, like, is aggressive when we're mad at each other with, like, he, like for example, she, he wants to punch me when we're, like, mad at each other, that's not okay. I'm gonna say deuces, you know? You got me fucked up. I don't want violence in a friendship, and I want no judgment. And I want someone that cheers me up, and I'll cheer you up, you know? I want you to trust me. Like, when you're sad, come to me, bro. Like, come on. Like, I can cheer you up. Although, like, I suck at, like, cheering people up. I can make you laugh. I know I'm funny, you know? What hasn't been invented yet, and do you consider it very necessary? I don't really know. That's like for smart people. <laughs> no, um, I don't know. That's a hard question. I'll come back to you later in life. What profession would you like to have? I want to be an actress. I really love acting. I love, 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 love acting. If I do not become an actress, then I want to become a theater teacher because acting is just, oh, it's so fun. Like, it's just, I love it. I really, really love it, and it cheers me up, and it's just like, it's like being another person for a day, it's just, psh, I love it. What is your daily playlist? My daily playlist is Aurora, like her music, I can't say her name right, yo, her music, like, I, okay, at first it was Erica Badu, but like, currently this whole month, it's been Aurora, because she's dope, and I just love her music, she's the shit dog, you know, it's so relaxing, and it just wants to, like, I just want to, like, be a hippie just for a day be like ooh, ooh, ooh. even though i can't dance for shit did you know did you know there are people from other countries who accompany you i am from brazil for example i did check because i'm weird okay i like keeping like i'm i'm creepy like honestly i'm i'm fucking creepy i like keeping track about like of um who watches my videos so sometimes i just like check who subscribes or um where people are in the world you know and it says that some people are from japan brazil china um korea like two percent of koreans watch me that's fucking crazy and some from africa bro it's fucking crazy like like what like you watch me like <laughs> thank you so much what are your goals for this year i used to be getting in a relationship but now i just like Honestly, I just want to take care of myself, you know? And I want to experiment more on my makeup skills and my aesthetics. Like, I know I don't just have two aesthetics. There's more out there that I haven't figured out yet that I liked. So I want to experiment more on my aesthetics and um, my makeup skills. And what, what other makeups I can do or like painting, you know? I, I kind of want to paint. Okay, so that's those questions on... Um, that there's another pile of questions next is from animation joy what do you do when you're bored i'm not gonna lie to you i just <gasps> currently currently i've been watching this show called sex education it's so good the first episode they're literally having sex so don't watch it in your living room do not watch it in your living room because that's not cute, you know? But yeah, they were having sex in the first episode. It's literally just about sex, you know? But um, it's so good and it's so cute and it, they're British and it's just, I love it. So check that out. I've been watching that. That's what I do when I'm bored. Like, 
currently i'm on season two when i started like last week so that's how you know i'm obsessed okay favorite song right now um seed or um on and on or um apple tree okay favorite movie okay like i haven't watched it but i know it's gonna be queen and slim i haven't watched it yet but i just know it's gonna be my favorite i just know i haven't watched it i really want to watch it okay favorite song everybody answer that what's your favorite thing to do to do all the time makeup i love no i love thrifting oh my god like if i had i'm not gonna lie to you if i had like a million dollars i'd go thrifting like like obviously i would like give some to my family and buy them stuff but i have to take care of myself now i'd be um, i'd buy my sister everything that she wished for in the whole world and then i'd go thrifting thrifting like oh I would just travel the world just thrifting and everywhere. I'd go thrifting in in India. I'd go thrifting in Korea. I'd go thrifting in Africa, bro. I'd go thrifting everywhere. You know, because I'm obsessed. Like, thrifting. They're heavy as fuck. I want to do my edges soon. I'm going to do them soon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Those are all... Oh my god, it looks like I'm fucking this thing. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, guys. Thank you guys so much for asking all these wonderful, wonderful questions. I love you, and I'm so glad. I'm so happy, you guys. You just... All these questions. Like, whoa. Like, whoa. <sighs> I'm fucking tired. My mouth hurts. Um, <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe. And um, don't forget to share this video. And um, thank you guys so much for all these questions. I hope you liked my answers to the beautiful questions that you I, you guys asked. And I hope I helped when um, with the... Uh, my mouth hurts, y'all. I don't feel like talking. <laughs> oh my god, I screamed so much yesterday. My voice is gone. Yo, I feel like this thing is staring at me. Oh my god. Uh-uh. You're gonna face that way, boy. Go subscribe to my sister's channel, My Comfort Zone. And thank you so much. Bye-bye.